our action research is about the effectiveness of bilingual education, English Filipino as medium of instruction in teaching mathematics. The authors are Evangeline B. Antoni, Janeline B. Fernandez, and yours truly, Adora B. Keniano. We are from Bulihan Elementary School, Municipality of GMA. There are several studies with regards to language as powerful tool to enhance the understanding of the learners in different subjects. Hence, this study wants to investigate the effects of using bilingual education, English Filipino as medium of instruction in teaching mathematics. Based on the first periodical learning outcome assessment of grade 5 for school year 2019-2020, mathematics got the lowest mean percentage score and specifically students of grade 5 Mabini with 40 pupils got 76.3%. This study aims to answer the following questions. Number one, what is the level of understanding mathematical concepts of pupils who were exposed to English as medium of instruction? Number two, what is the level of understanding mathematical concepts of pupils who were exposed to bilingual education, English Filipino as medium of instruction? And number three, is there a significant difference with the level of understanding mathematical concepts between the students who were exposed to English as medium of instruction and the students who were exposed to bilingual education, English Filipino? This study is limited to 40 pupils of grade 5 Mabini Abulihan Elementary School during the school year 2019-2020 who got a low mean percentage scores during the first quarter examination. This study employed quasi-experimental design. The researchers used validated DLL for the two lessons, which was presented in English medium of instruction and bilingual English-Filipino respectively. Summative tests were given to establish the effectiveness of the program. Shown in the graph, the level of understanding mathematical concepts between bilingual English Filipino and English as medium of instruction. The researchers used English as medium of instruction in teaching adding and subtracting decimal numbers and employed bilingual as medium of instruction in teaching solving routine and then routine word problem involving addition and subtraction of decimal numbers. Both results were proficient. This table shows that there is no significant difference in the level of understanding mathematical concept in teaching mathematics using English instruction and bilingual instruction, English Filipino with different competency. Furthermore, based from the result of the summative test in adding and subtracting decimal numbers presented in English and bilingual instruction, English Filipino, the p-value is 0.515 which implies that there is no significant difference at p less than 0 0.05. However, given the result of the summative test in solving routine and non-routine word problem involving addition and subtraction of decimal numbers presented in English instruction and bilingual instruction English-Filipino, there is a significant difference with the p-value of 0 0.001 which signifies that the medium of instruction has an effect in teaching word problems in mathematics. Based from the result of the study, bilingual education has a salient point in teaching mathematics, especially in solving word problems, considering the English language proficiency of the pupils. The result of this study shows that bilingual education, English-Filipino, has a positive feedback despite the difficulty of the topic.